What's up, YouTube? Mco40 here. I'm giving you guys some really, really, really big news um, in the Yu-Gi-Oh world. Some interesting things actually happened. Um, the Yu-Gi-Oh license has actually expanded out far beyond what we're currently engaged in in the game. Um, the first stop was actually the Heroclix brand. Um, Heroclix is going to be picking up Yu-Gi-Oh, and we're going to see the game branch out further. And it's going to be really cool to see the concepts that Heroclix can give to Yu-Gi-Oh! And, you know, how Yu-Gi-Oh! is going to branch out into the Heroclix game. Um, I'm still, you know, rather new to the whole concept behind Heroclix. So I'm very curious to know what people are going to do with Heroclix. And what Yu-Gi-Oh! and Heroclix merging together for the um, thing is going to be. Uh, by no chance is Konami selling the rights, or basically... The rights. Um, what's going on is actually Heroclix is going to get the rights to use Yu-Gi-Oh in their games. Uh, Konami will still own the trading card game uh, by all stretches of the imagination, which is severely cool and everything. And it means that you know we're going to get to see more cool stuff um, in terms of Yu-Gi-Oh inside of other games, which is really really astounding that they would even consider doing this. And I'm really excited to see what it is. So basically. It's really cool to see this. And then the second big thing that happened, um, the way that it looks, um, the Yu-Gi-Oh! artwork is actually getting licensed to someone for actual use. Um, I don't know how this is going to affect things, you know, in terms of, you know, what we can expect to see. Uh, but the company called Nika is actually going to get the rights to use the artwork. So kudos to everyone for this. This is some really big news. I'm very curious to see how this is going to impact um, the game, especially outside of the USA, you know, in Britain and whatnot, I believe all of these contracts are not valid in Asia, um, but they are valid here in the States, Britain, and everywhere else, and it's going to be really, really big to see what people have to say about this. So this is probably some of the biggest Yu-Gi-Oh! news that we've seen in a very long time, especially in terms of, you know, another game actually getting the rights to, you know, have Yu-Gi-Oh! stuff inside of it, and I'm very curious to see how this is going to impact the game's popularity, such as Hero Clicks, because you can now use the Dark Magician, you know, I believe the quote was, kill Batman with the Dark Magician, I think I don't think you can put any better words than that, so, um, let me know what you guys have to say about this, this is some really rather big news, especially, you know, in terms of the way that Yu-Gi-Oh! is going, and I'm very curious to see what is around the corner for this, so remember, leave a comment down below, tell me what you have to say about this, this is some really, really big, important news for the game so i hope you guys enjoy this and i'm definitely glad to be one of the first people to bring you guys this news later guys